Well, the 2011 Red Sox had one more choke left in them. They had the chance to trade John Lackey, and they blew it. One of the biggest culprits of the Red Sox monumental historic collapse of 2011 was pitcher John Lackey, who stunk on the mound, he stunk in the clubhouse, and he stunk off the field. Lackey had a 6.41 ERA, which is historically bad for a full season. And he was one of the pitchers who, instead of rehabbing his injuries, was playing Xbox, eating fried chicken, and pounding beers in the clubhouse. And he's owed $40 million guaranteed. And despite all that, the San Diego Padres were evidently interested in trading for him. But now John Lackey has to have surgery, and he's going to miss all of next season. So he's more worthless than he was before, if that's even possible. The Red Sox should have made a deal the nanosecond they heard the Padres were interested. We're interested in John Lackey. Fine, he's yours. No, wait, you haven't even heard our demands. What are you offering in exchange for John Lackey? Use Kleenex? Fine. A can of flat Sprite? Perfect. The sequel rights to Green Lantern? Where do I sign? If the Padres had insisted that someone drive him from Fenway to San Diego, everybody in New England would have said, I've got a car. I bet someone would have taken him by rickshaw to San Diego. If the Padres had offered a player who was alive, it would have been a steal. If they had offered a player who was dead, it still would have been a good deal. He's dead, Jim. The Red Sox should have offered to pay his full salary. Sometimes a player just doesn't fit on a team, and you gotta ship him off even if you get nothing in return. Let me put it this way. Lackey is to the Red Sox what Charlie Sheen was to two and a half men. Wow, what does that mean? The stink of 2011 has to be washed off. I know this is sacrilegious, but they should take a year to rebuild. There are some good pieces to this team, but they have to stop signing big price free agents who don't fit, like Lackey. So there's two months left in 2011. Please tell me you're done choking, Red Sox. To see more Sully Baseball videos, click here to subscribe.